What is happening in the Papagayo area? Well, let me tell you, there's a lot going on and it's magnificent. So this area known as the Papagayo, and the Papagayo means the parrot, this was designated to be what it is today. This did not happen by luck. In the 80s, the government of Costa Rica said, we want to find one area in our country that we can develop for resort tourism development, resort tourism investment, where foreigners could easily fly in stay here at these beautiful beaches, explore the country, and easily go home, where these big developments would create hundreds and thousands of jobs and tens of millions of tax dollars for the country, where the best infrastructure in the whole country would exist. That's the area known as the Papagaya. It started in the early 2000s with a group that bought that peninsula right over my shoulder and announced that they were going to build a $500 million Four Seasons Hotel. The development is called Peninsula Papagaya. Since that time, they built a five-star Andaz Hotel, a 90-slip state-of-the-art marina that holds the mega yachts, and they're in the process of completing a Ritz-Carlton Hotel. There's also plans coming up for a sixth senses, which is another very high-end resort. These resorts are incredible because they bring an astronomical amount of investment and tax dollars to Costa Rica. As you go around the bay, there are some beautiful all-inclusive hotels. There's a Secrets Hotel, a Planet Hollywood, and a Grand Occidental. There's also a Mangrove Marriott, along with two Ryu hotels. And being built right now, we've been waiting for it a long time, is the gorgeous Waldorf Astoria Hotel that is going to employ another 500 or 1,000 local Costa Ricans with some very high paying, good quality jobs. Why are the resorts important? The resorts are important because not only do they create jobs and not only do they bring lots of tax dollars, but they're the reason we have the best infrastructure. We have beautifully paved roads, we have fiber optic internet, we have hospitals, we have police, fire, ambulances, because of the resorts. Yet the resorts are located in kind of remote areas. People hear the word resorts and they panic. Oh my God, there's gonna be all these people running around with yellow Hilton armbands. Yet to get from those resorts to here is a one hour drive. They're in very remote areas and we're in the middle of those resorts. So we benefit with the infrastructure and we benefit with the tax dollars, yet we don't feel like we're inundated with a bunch of tourists coming over, walking through our town from the resorts. Come down and check it out, it's pretty impressive.